In this video, we're going to take a look at solving percent problems. There are two common ways we can solve percent problems, and in this video, we're going to focus on setting up a proportion, which can be used to solve the percent problem. The percent proportion, I like to summarize as being is over of equals percent over 100. And if you can remember this proportion, is over of equals percent over 100, we can solve any percent problem by setting it up in this way. Something important to remember while we look at this proportion, this over 100 part is only for percent problems. A common error students run into is they will see this proportion and think it works for solving any proportion. Well, if there's no percents in the problem, we don't do the over 100 part. You have to look at what the problem gives you to set up the proportion. But with percent problems, is over of equals percent over 100. So if we have a percent problem such as 16 is what percent of 20, what we're going to do is divide this sentence up into three parts. And the parts are split up after every other word. So if we look 16 is, we'll put a divider, what percent, put a divider, of 20, we have every number paired off with one of these key words in the proportion is over of equals percent over 100. The first block here, is, is with the number 16. That's our is. Over of, of is with the number 20. Equals percent, percent is with the word what, meaning we don't know the percent, x over 100. And you notice this sets up a proportion, 16 over 20 equals x over 100, which we could use to solve for x to answer the question. We're not going to solve it at this point. Right now, I just want to focus on setting up these proportions using is over of equals percent over 100. So let's try another example. Here we have 52 percent of 68 is what? We can split this sentence up into parts, 52 percent of 68 is what? And now we can start thinking of that proportion, is over of equals percent over 100, which means we start with is. Is is with the word what? That must be our variable. Is over of, of is with the word or number, 68 equals percent. The percent is with the 52 over 100, and that gives us a proportion which we could use to answer the question and find out 52 percent of 68 is what? Setting up this proportion, is over of equals percent over 100 can be used to solve these percent problems.